bro. I just don't know what to do. This past few days has, has not been easy for me. You see, Justin, your wife told me so many striking things about herself. Let me ask you, how much of your wife do you know? I mean, come on, we, well, we, we, do, we do talk, but not always. Yeah. You see, after discussing with your wife, I realized something was lacking. Communication. Communication lacks in your marriage. And this is one very important, I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, very important thing you need in your marriage. You know why? It bonds the two of you. It makes you understand each other very, very well. But in your own case, it is lacking. I don't know if you get my point. Your wife is a rare gem, one of a kind. Please try and know your wife, bond with your wife. And you'll be happy you did. Ben, you're my friend. I have to tell you the truth. You see, my wife carries me. I mean, adores me like a king. So the fact that she doesn't monitor my movement and makes me just, you know, gives me that freedom to live life the way I want is beginning to hurt me. It's beginning to hurt me. Like no matter what I do, she doesn't even feel it at all. You know when a man hurts a when a man hurts a woman and 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 you you know how how how, how bad you feel. So the fact that I don't get those feelings is beginning to torment me. I don't know how to fix this. I want a way to fix this with my wife. You see. Let me shock you. Uju, Uju is not angry. She's not even worried. Really? You wouldn't believe it. She is not. You see, that's, that's my fear. <laughs> you see, Justin. It's not her fault, uh, but it is, it, is, it, is, it, is, it is expected anyway. Ordinarily, when a man offends the wife, especially when you cheat on her, there is this reaction you expect to get. Find out her do's and her don'ts. Spend time with your wife. She's a real gem. See that woman? Yeah, naturally, it is expected that when, when a man, a man cheats on his wife, she will react. It's, it, 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 it's a natural thing. But in your own case, it doesn't happen. That's she's that. too max in. When you're expecting her to react, she's just, she's, she's just there. Man, man, the woman has seen a lot. So that has built her mind. That is why she doesn't bother you when you do all these things. However, you shouldn't be taken for granted. You get settled with your wife. Communicate with your wife. Bond more with her. Bond more. Take her out, just her. You enjoy that woman. See with you? You enjoy her. Thanks, man. That's right, Apologizing to me, and you're angry with me. What? Yes. Apologize to you for what? Huh? Listen, please. Don't put words into my mouth. All right? Live your life the way you want it, and leave me the hell alone. I beg you. Wait, wait, wait a minute. I just, I, I want to know. 
And you've seen another woman. Oh yes, I am. I thought you knew. I said, so speaking, why? Am I not good enough for you? Why are you doing this? Emily, I had a very long day at work today. Okay? I came back home so I can rest. So just leave me alone. Babe. I am... Um, I, I know I must have acted... bad... in recent times, but... that's not the way to correct me. What about the love we share? Have you suddenly forgotten that? The love we used to share, right? The love we used to share. Listen, it's obvious we're not in love with each other anymore. Okay? Because I can't remember the last time we talked about love. It's all in the past, yeah? As is not enough reason to bring another woman into the house. Please. It's enough reason to bring another woman into the house. And for your information, the same attitude you're displaying right now is why I cheated on my ex. My first wife, yes. And I'm about to cheat on you too. If you keep doing this. Pasibiki, for goodness sake, how would you feel if I cheat on you? It's okay! I won't be surprised if you're cheating on me. I mean, I'm not God. Who knows if you're cheating on me right now? Listen, if we can't share healthy intimacy, then there's no point being together. Don't you think so? There's no point. Like they say, how you make your bed is how you lie on it. What you sow is what you reap. That's exactly what is happening to me I am responsible for what is happening to me I was looking out for myself Try to please myself Now I realize that there's no gain In causing all this pain Oh, what a shame Chiu, I don't want to lose my home I don't want to. My husband looked me in the face and told me that he could see another woman. What do I do? I don't, I, don't, I don't want to lose my home. I told you, you need to adjust. Yes, in every home, one needs to adjust for things to work out. But you can only walk away when you feel you can no longer fit in. I just want my husband. I just want my home. <laughs> I can't do anything to keep that man. I, I, don't, I don't want to lose him. <sighs> Come on. Marriage is not a do or die affair. No. It's not a crime for you to walk away. But if there is every possibility, for you to stay back and adjust, then do it. Besides, there is no perfect home out there. Okay, I am. Um, I want to adjust. Yes. You do? I do. It's okay. <laughs> Just go back home. Have a word with your husband. You both to have one-on-one. -on -one. Talk to each other. And do everything he wants you to do. Make sure you do everything. Ask him what he wants you to do for things to work out. Remember, you have to be flexible with your decision this time around. I beg you. Place. Go! 
please, whatever your name is, I am not here to see your madam. I need to see your girl, Mr. Zubike. Can I go in, please? Oh, man, no. You are here to see your girl. In Yanga, they sleep, trouble, they wake up. If you have any message for Oga, give it to me. I will take it straight to him. This is the one place to stay. Oh. You are talking rubbish. Excuse me. Hey, 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 hey. Allow me. Hey, hey. Hey, hey. hey. Yes, um, young lady, who are you? She said she wants to see your girl. Can you just keep your mouth shut, you oh, porcupine? Well, I didn't ask you. <sighs> Sorry, how may I help you, please? My name is Isabella. I'm here to see Mr. Hey, that had reason! That had reason! You just keep oh. shut. Are you sick or something? Um, sorry. I'm his wife, so whatever message you have for him, you can give to me. I'll pass it on to him. That's very nice. Thank you. I am pregnant. Yes. Sorry, the last time I checked, my house is um, not a lab, neither is it a hospital, so what are you doing here? Okay, I am pregnant for him. <laughs> yes. For him. I don't understand. Did you have to come to this house? What kind of stupid question is that? Azubike, do you pick my calls? Do you respond to my messages to you? I call you, you don't pick. I send you messages, you do not reply. Oh, you want me to suffer this thing alone? No, it will not happen. We enjoyed it together and we are going to suffer together. Yes. Sweet. How could you? How could you do this to me? Where did I go wrong? What did I do to you? How could you do... What? What, what did you say? Are you out of your mind? It is your fault! You pushed me into doing this! And if you have nothing to say, just shut the hell up! What? Um, please, uh, you guys can fight when I'm gone. Not when I'm here, please. You can settle your family problems later. But you see me, I'm not leaving here. Just settle me and let me go. You are going to leave my house. Just sick or something. Can't you see that he is a married man? He didn't know he was married and he was sleeping with me. He didn't know. No, madam. You are a very heartless person. You see a pregnant woman like me and you're talking to me like this. I should go out and suffer alone. No, it will not happen. We are suffering. In fact, I don't even have time. You call me heartless in my You're heartless. Home. I am heartless.
Please, can we talk? What is it? I am... Um, <clears throat> I just want to... I want to know what you want our home to be now. You don't expect me to answer that question, do you? I'm not in the mood. Please. I just want us to fix things. I just want us to make things right. I'm ready to be a changed person. I, I don't want us to keep fighting, please. Or are you, are you still planning on sending me away? Angli, I'm not sending you away. But you must understand that you're no longer that woman I fell in love with. I'm still that woman, I promise you. I, I just need you to give me the chance to prove myself to you. I'm still the same Angolika you met, please. Please, babe, I'm begging you, please. All right, first, I want my kids back. And when they come back, you must accept them as your children. Okay, it's fine. I promise to bring them back today. And I would never raise a hand on them. I would never even shout at them, please. Easier said than done. I promise I would not do it. I'm a changed person. Please. Secondly, I need you to employ someone to handle your business. And you would visit your business premises once in a while. My love, you know my business is... The business is still growing. I can't afford to get an external staff now. It's, it's a small business. How do I pay the person? And I need to be there to oversee things as well. How much do you need to make that happen? Say, um, five million naira. Five million. If that's going to bring my wife back home, I'll give you five million. Thank you. Listen, Angoli. I have missed you so much, and I'll do anything it takes for you to come back home. Don't you understand? And I miss you too. Thank you. Thank you. So tell me, what do we do about the girl outside? Do you, um, do you want to marry her? Marry her? She's pregnant. How can I marry a girl? You know what? How can I marry a girl like that? Very well then. If that's the case, then I'll handle it. It's fine. How do you intend to handle it? Not to worry. I'll handle it. Excuse me. At this junction, go. Go! Why not go? Go now. Eh? You go now, you good. Like they say, how you make your bed is how you lie on it. What you sow is what you reap. That's exactly what is happening to me. 
I am responsible for what is happening to me. I was I want us to talk myself. woman to woman. <laughs> Well, it depends on the kind of talk, of course. I don't know what I don't know what I want to talk about. Mm. What do you want from us? What do I want? Madam, I am pregnant. If you want to take me to the hospital, it's not a problem. I am pregnant. I am not going to suffer this alone. It's not possible now. You're a woman, you understand this now. If I give you money. Would you leave me and my family alone? Anyway, it depends on the amount involved. Two million naira. Are you doing it or not? So where's the money? When am I getting it? equivalent of two million naira. I want you to take this money and stay away from my family. I don't want to see you an inch close to my husband. If I smell you anywhere around here. I'll eat you alive. Don't touch my money. And you can keep it now. But make sure you beg him very well so that he will not come and start begging me. Give it to him very well. Satisfy him. Good advice. Have it. Next week. Baba. Madam. Make sure I don't see this thing anywhere around my house. Uh, Next uh, time I see her close to this building, you are as good as dead. Um, Do I make myself care? Baba, Baba, Baba. Have you done your homework now? Ah, uh, right. Madam, your bag. Take it inside. Oh, and um. Someone gave you this amount of money. Are you serious? I took it, but I don't think this is what I need. I don't understand. You mean you've been meeting people with your pregnancy? Lucy, I can't believe you could say this about me. Why? Anyways, Azubike's wife gave me this money. She gave me the money to pay me off. <laughs> to pay me off. Mm. Hey, in that case, your father must know about this. Okay. I mean, at this point, I think it's better you come straight and tell me to leave your house. I'll go. No, no, that's not what I meant. Then why did you inform? I mean, why are you involving my father? You know, see, I told you something. My father does not like my life. I don't want him involved in my life, in anything that concerns me. This one clearly told me I can never amount to anything in my life. Yes, and he froze my account so I can live the life he wants me to live. Hell no! Are you bringing my father into this? You mean he said all this to you? In that case, this is the time for you to prove him wrong by living right. You're still smoking. Azubike, what are you saying? You mean you had something to do with another woman? The Mecca honestly, I can't explain how it happened. But the same reason I was asking my wife to change. See, Azubike, you are not doing yourself any good. You are placing a negative tag on yourself. And you know, 
It's not telling good of you. Eh? My wife sorted out everything. Who is she? I mean, how did you get to meet her? Rebecca, it's a long story. One of those days my wife denied me of my conjugal rights. I was lonely. I I went out. I had a lot to drink and couldn't remember what happened after that. Shall we? This is it. Sit down. Angolika, I can clearly see you're not ready to change. Do you know I've been home since 5 p.m.? Yeah. I've been home with the kids. We've been waiting for you to return. I put them to sleep. You got back. And now, I feel like it is time for me to spend some time with my wife. And all you do is tell me, oh, honey, go to the dining and uh, I, have, I have things to do. Why are you like this? Masubike, what is it? Hmm? What is it? What will I do in this house that would just, that would just be okay with you? Why do you keep keep attacking me for every little thing. I do these things because of you. Why are you complaining? Listen are we going to go on like this for the rest of our lives? Yes. If you don't want this constant quarrel, then you have to listen to me. I, I know I'm a romantic guy, but that part of me is gone because you don't even give me attention. You don't spend time with me. Sometimes I feel like we should eat together, dine together. Do things together. Wait, I mean, Azubiki, Azubiki, Biko, 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 yeah, Biko, you, 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 you're nagging too much these days. You're beginning to nag and it's really getting on my Is nerves. that what you're saying? Yes, that is what I'm saying. Funny enough, women pray for attention, but now I don't even understand. You're the one craving for attention. You're becoming a drama king. So that's what you're saying? That is exactly what I am saying. That I'm nagging too much? Azubiki, your food is on the table. Please, go and eat. I still need to finish washing the dishes. Taking care of the children's clothes, even your own clothes. Pico, let me be. Angoli, when the right time comes. What will happen? We shall see. As we keep come on, it's your fault. Where's my car key? Okay, it's your car key. Ah, car key. As we keep, where are you going at this time of the night? As we keep. Hello? Anyone here? Can I sit? Yes, you can sit. All right, thank sit you. Um, you come here often? Um, not really. really. Just sometimes. My name is Azubike. Okay. Isabella is my name. Nice to meet you. Okay. Um, I'm here to have a few bottles, you know, okay. and also clear my head. I, I have a lot I need to get off my chest, you know. We need that sometimes. Yeah. You, you mind I call for a drink? Yeah, that's okay. I was, I was actually going to call out for, okay. you know, a bomb just... man, so. Waiter! What? It's 
it's me. Did anything happen? What have I done? <laughs> what have you done? <laughs> oh my God. I cannot believe I had the best sex in my life. God, you are good. <laughs> Listen, whatever happened between us was a mistake. No. Please, whatever happened was a mistake. That's your business. I'm a married man. I'm married. Okay. And I had fun. I had fun. In fact, we can have just one more time. You must be out of your mind. Come on, just one more time. Come on. Okay. Emeka, honestly, I can't remember how it all happened. You know me. If I was in my right senses, I won't touch another woman. Azubiki, you mean you slept with another woman without using protection? Is that how careless you can be? I honestly... I, I didn't remember, you know, using... Protecting myself. I was drunk. What if this woman in question has infected you with a virus? God forbid. I went to the hospital and I was clean. That just hope so. Listen, I haven't experienced this before, okay? And I, I apologize for my carelessness. However, I, I'm yet to find out how she located me. Do you remember me? Please excuse me, I need to drive. So you don't remember me? I'm asking you, do you remember me? You're saying, excuse me, I need to drive. I don't remember you. Okay, you can't remember me? No. Two weeks ago, you carried me, you picked me from the street, and we went to the hotel. You can't remember me? You must be mad. Please get off. Oh, you want us to shout now? You want us to shout now? Ask me if I'm mad. You want us to shout now? I am not mad. I am not mad. Okay, okay. No problem. When you were having unprotected sex, I said, leave me alone. Leave me alone. You said no. I said, stop, stop. You said no. You want to come. You are finished coming inside. You are telling me what. No. See, 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 see. I am pregnant. Now you are telling me that you don't remember me. When I'm ready, you will know. I will give you time to sing. Please. Okay. Wait till I reach. You know what's keeping this in the I think you're crazy. Okay. Okay, we will know it's crazy that time. Good day, son. Good day, what can I do for you? Um, I told you I'll be back. Here I am. Please, I asked you a question. What's, what can I do for you? Stop wasting my time. What can I do for you? Do you realize I can be a mad girl anytime? And if you want my madness, I can easily unleash it. Okay, I am pregnant. What do you want us to do about this? Listen and listen good. I can remember offering you a lot of money. Right? I know I paid you off. So what are you doing here? I'm here because I enjoyed every bit of it and I want more. Is that too much to ask? Listen, I'm going to call the security to throw you out. I will not stop you from calling the security either. I will not. Go ahead and call the security. Perhaps we could discuss this issue in front of your security. And if you want me to go, I will. But anywhere we see, we are going to talk about this. Excuse me. Emeka, I thought she was joking. And the next minute I saw her in my house. Huh? My goodness. 
this will really hurt your wife so bad. What are you going to do about it? My wife gave her some money and she left. I pray she never returns. Do you support her to abort your child? Well, I never said that, but are you saying I, I should get married to her? Well, I'm not saying you should get married to her, but for the sake of your child, you need to secure the life of that unborn child. <sighs> you know, this is the second time this is happening to me. And sometimes I wonder if it's genetic or something is wrong with me. There is nothing genetic here. This is a case of carelessness from your end. You know, you always vent your frustration wrongly. And it ends up landing you in a big trouble. Huh? How do you undo this now? You know what? I just pray she never returns. That's all I have to say. So, what becomes of your child? Emeka, why are you interrogating me? Are you insinuating that I get married to her? Well, I never said so. Who's there? Come in, come in. you sow is what you reap. That's exactly what is happening to me. I am responsible for what is happening to me. I was looking out for myself, trying to please myself. Now I realize that there's no gain in causing all this pain. Come on, bring me. Oh, what a shame. Oh. Won't you come and grip? I've missed you so much. To blame because of my efforts. Now I feel, I feel so much pain. Oh, so much shame. Oh, oh, oh. My daughter, I do not want you to abort that child. Is that clear? It is a taboo where I come from. It's also against my beliefs as a core traditionalist. Do you get that? I don't want to abort it. That's I want it. to keep the child. All right. But I hope that young man is still single. I hope he's still single. He's married, Papa. He's married with kids. Married with kids? How can you sleep with a, a married man without protection? That is why I always have problems with you. You do dangerous things without thinking of the aftermath effect. Do you think I hate you? I don't. I mean... I love this man so much and I fell in love with him the very first time I met him. You are in love with him? That's to say you are ready to settle for a second wife. You want to be the second wife? Answer me. You want to be the second wife? Honey, you remember we need to visit Mama today. 
I didn't forget. <laughs> I remember. I was wondering, do you think Oma and Obi would like to visit again? <sighs> I'm sure they would. I, um, um, I'll talk to them. I'm pretty sure they'll forgive me. What do you think? It's okay. Just be hopeful. Hey! Hey, okay. There is fire on the mountain. Oh, what must will be annoying? I smell trouble. Some people are there. They want to see you. Who are they? But at this juncture, they came with bodyguards. Hey! Bodyguards, yo! Hey, hey, put your voice down. Is that why you're shouting? Oh, man. Uh -uh. Where are they? <laughs> Damo? Outside the gate. Outside the gate. Bring your voice down. This is this is not only chat. I don't know why you keep shouting no. like a madman. Go, go and open the gate. Madam. He just said go open and get the gate. The gate. 50 men. No, no. Get out. Whoop. Get out. Hey, whoop. Hey. Are you expecting anyone today? Um, not really. Uh, let's go. Let's find out. out there in the court. What court? And I'll give you two ways to decide that. Hey, hey, hey. I hope you can. Wait for where You have seen it. I hope you're happy now. You heard what I said? Is it clear to you? It will not happen. I am. Um, I want to understand what's going on. Are you telling me you are going to bring that lady into our home? What would you have me do? Fight the police? I was asked to take care of the pregnant girl and that's the right thing of to do. Of course you can take care of her, but you don't have to do that here. You cannot bring her into our home. Go out there, get an apartment for her, pay for it and foot her bills until she puts to bed. I tried to do that, but she refused and well, she said she wants to stay here. And you just... would have to refuse too. That is it. You would have to refuse too. You can't bring that woman into this house. No way. Then you're expecting me to fight the father. But no, I'm not winning. I'll lose the fight. Why are you so relaxed? No, why are you so comfortable? Are you telling me you are going to take in that woman and her bastard? Is that what you're telling me? Hang on me. That child is not a bastard. I'm the father. <laughs> wow. Congratulations to the newest father in town. You were so comfortable telling me that you were going to take him, that woman and her bastard. That is not going to happen. That woman is not going to come into this house. It will not happen. I would rather die than let that woman come into my home, over my dead body, or I will go back to my father's house. You either choose me or her, because I would not have it. I won't take it. That woman won't come into my home. Jesus, do you know, do you know what? to keep this home. Do you know how many times I have tried to keep this home? I have done everything to keep you, to keep myself, and keep everything. I won't have it. I would not take it. That woman won't come into this home. It would not happen.
I wanted something better for you. I wanted you to go to the university, make good grades, secure a good job, and have great men gushing after you. It is unfortunate I cannot live the kind of life that you want me to live. Papa, in your word, you said I am the dumbest person alive, and you might be right. You just might be right. Papa, I am not good with education. I cannot live the life you want me to live. Can't you see? But even if you cannot live the life I want you to live, it still can be someone better. You can still choose a part in life mm. that everyone around you will be proud of. Papa, just leave me alone. Let me be. You seized every single thing that I have just to bend to your wish. Papa, since the day I left you, by now you should know I cannot even... I can't, I can't change. This is me. Okay. Let me start sorrying, Dad. I am your father. And nothing can change that. I've already denied you my support, but now I'll do that no more. Oh. As long as you do nothing illegal, you have my support. You have said that before, Papa, and nothing changed. People have always blamed me for being too harsh on you. I'm giving you the fatherly rules I denied you. Yes, henceforth. Do with your life whatever you wish. But have it at the back of your mind that the life you're living is not what I planned for you. I wish you said this earlier. I'm sorry. It's coming too late, but I'll make it up. I'll make it up. I'll make it up, my daughter. Stop crying. I'm sorry, my daughter. Though it's coming too late, I'll make it off to you. And your father, I know the kind of person that I am. I'll make it up to you. Stop crying, my daughter. Please stop crying. Stop crying. We don't cry again. Hmm? I'll make it up to you. It is playing out, Chiwe. It is playing out before my very own eyes. Angoli, what happened? Put yourself together and speak to me. <laughs> Chewie, my husband has finally done it. My worst fears has come to play. <laughs> my husband has impregnated another girl. This is sickening. What is wrong with your husband? Why can't he hold himself? Three women in a row? No. No. Your husband is so irresponsible. I don't know what to do. Chiwe, I don't know what to ha. do. With that girl's body language, if she moves into my home, I am finished. Chiwe, what do I Please hold on. Hold yourself together. Oh. What is your husband saying about this? Mm -hmm. I mean, what is his reactions towards this? Mm -hmm. He wants to bring her into our home. My husband wants to bring that girl into our home. <sighs> Do you know, it's all my fault. I just wish I could turn back the hands of time. I want my husband back. I want my home. I don't want to lose my husband. 
I don't want to lose him, Chiwe. I don't want to. It's okay. I don't even know what to say. I'm, I'm so speechless. Please, just put yourselves together. I can't. Remember you have your children with you. Please, I beg you. Please. This is not happening. The man is ready to take me to court if I don't cooperate with his daughter. So what is the girl saying? What do they want you to do? They just want me to be around her. But the girl knows you are married. She's aware I'm married. But I feel like the devil is just trying to use her to destroy my family. You see, I've been telling you not to allow such a thing to happen. Eh? This is a very big problem that you just involved yourself now. I understand how you feel, but... I don't understand why a young, vibrant, beautiful girl would would want to cause trouble in my family. You see, that shows how irresponsible she is. You don't need such a woman in your life. Huh? You always allow the problem of your family to make you make mistakes that will affect you. Huh? What are you going to do now? My mother said my father married six wives. And I'm beginning to think something is wrong with me. If not, could this be a pattern in my family or a template I must follow? As we can see, let me tell you something. No woman is perfect. If care is not taken, you end up taking more wives, just like your father did. You just have to be careful. Mm. Babe, you still insist on going to live with that man? Do you have a problem with that? Oh, so you don't see any problem with it? Babes, you can't cease to amaze me. Like, what, what happened? Like, what did this man do to you that you just took the decision of going to live with him? Like a married man. Hey, hey, hey. listen. You really want to know what this man did to me? I've told you this thing before. <laughs> In bed. <laughs> Only that man they thought that sport. Who be the man? <laughs> they never born anybody. My sister, if this guy handle you, leave. Forget it. Ah, no, no, no. no. Don't even hey. go there. See the advice. It's not even important. I mean, you're just so funny. Like, you mean the criteria to getting an ideal man is someone who is good in bed? Babe, are you, are you even listening to yourself? What, what is wrong with you? Are you okay? Lucy, can we just end this conversation now? Please, can we? Can we? Please. You are different from me. I am different from you. We have different orientations. Can you respect my wish so I respect yours? Please. What useless wish? Please, leave that married man alone. <laughs> leave him alone. Mm. Well, I blame him for, for being promiscuous. But I can't support you to go live with a married man and then put problem in his family. Which, which, which family? Which family? Who cares about the family? My sister, what I care about right now is my happiness and that's all that matters to me. Anyways, I, I, he should be outside now waiting for me. So let me just go and see him. Meanwhile, no need to escort me. Just let me go on my own. Waiting for you. Do you realize you've been keeping me waiting? Hold it right there. Just hold it. Why are you shouting? Why? 
If you're ready to take me, please let's go. No, I'm not ready to take you. I've been here waiting for you. So? Is that why you're shouting? Please get in, let's go. No, 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 no. Hold it. You're not ready for me. You're, see, you're not even ready for me now. I don't like this thing. No. Babe, please, you have to calm down. You don't have to start now. Please. Please get please. inside, let's go. If he wants it now. hot, I will give him hot. And if he wants it cold, I will give him cold. Get in. See him shouting. like that. How am I supposed to know those dirty pigs were your kids? Did you think they must tend me? Do you want to get a dirty slap from me? Did she needs a slap from you. This idiot needs a slap from you. Wait, my own children. The children I carried in my wombs. Those are the ones you're calling pig. I don't know. It is you and your generation that are pigs. Are you, you your grandmother, your grandfather, everybody in your family. Are you big care? What is girl? What who? What is your wife for? What now? What now? Can't take anything from you, but you see, calling my children names. Mm. Ha ha! My dear, I will not take it. I will not take it from anyone. You will not try it. You see what you cost. You will not try what? See, because you see where your madness started. That's where my own will stop. Uh -huh. Have you heard me? Where your own started is where my own will stop. My sister, don't try me. Yeah, my madness. Mm. Listen, I can't take anything from you, but you see, calling my children names. Mm. Ah, my dear, I will not take it. I will not take it, but you will see the other side of me if you try it. And your other side of me, when your other side sees the other side of me, your other side will drop. And fear my other side. Fear my other side. Fear my other side. Fear my other side. Because my other side runs. So what will happen? Your ginger, your kidney, everything will not survive it. What will happen? As we get a quick prayer. You should come and say something as we get. Don't go as we get. Say something. You brought it. Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? I said talk to her. As we get on the side. You cannot talk to her. You cannot talk. What happened? Jessica, sister just called me. She said her husband has brought in another woman into the house. Eh? Huh? Would he have brought in another man? Hey, 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 Jessica, let today be the first and the last you will tell me anything about that your sister called Amoreka. Taburigi is in Ikbazo. In Anuya. Mama, she said they, 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 they are fighting. I even heard the woman's voice in the background. She said the woman has been fighting her ever since she got into that house. Mm. Yes. Um, Jessica, please, go inside and prepare my food for me. Biko. Go and get me food. Mama, I still think that we should find a way to help sister. Mama, I'm talking to you. Okay, you are right. We should find a way to help her. At least you for fight for her. Why do you come and tell me? You're supposed to go and fight for her now. Get inside, go and get me my food. Oh, see, so I should be back with it. Get! What are you standing for? What is she looking for? Hey, who? Hey, get back, get back, get back, get back, get back. Mama, get back, get back. I hear background. I hear. Hey, you for here up ground. Not only background. Now, up ground, you will hear this time. Hey, who are you, baby? I'll be for Nanya. What are you doing here? What are you doing here? Sorry for what? I'm sorry, I'm in so much trouble right now, Mama. I will not allow you to enter this house until you tell the women of this family. You tell the women of this family how you cut me and your husband. Hey, Mama, I, I, Leave my house. So I didn't say that. Oh! 
So, wait, I am now a liar. No, Mama, Mama, you are not. Why are you Mama, 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 Mama. Mama. So, I, you are now a liar. No, you Your punishment will be double. Hey. If you ever lie to Mama, me, get out of my house. Mama, please, get out of my house. Leave my house.